Welcome aboard to San Diego Express. While this train is in motion, please remain seated, keeping all hands, arms, and legs inside the train at all times. the bongo antelope. Bongo antelope were thought to be the ghosts of the forest. The reason for that is because they're nocturnal animals. They only come out early in the morning and late at night. They're absolutely gorgeous. They're a medium brown color and they have vertical stripes up and down their body. On the left hand side of the train you can see some white rhinoceros over there. 
The white rhinoceros are in back of that tree that we're going by. White rhinoceros happen, used to be called white rhinos because the uh, W-I-D-E and the reason for that is because their lower jaw is very wide. Actually, through the years, they got translated to mean wide ri white rhino when there's nothing white about them. They don't see very well. They can actually run at speeds of about 30 miles an hour. I don't know about you, but I don't want to be running 30 miles an hour, and I want to be able to see about 8 feet in front of them. These mountain zebras live in the mountains, and because of that fact, in order, in order for them to go up and down the mountain trails, they have smaller hooks than most other zebras. And on the right-hand side of the train, you can turn around and see some uh, wildebeest. Well, the beasts actually are not the McDonald's, the Serengeti, which a lot of people think they are, but they are attacked an awful lot by predators. And that's why they travel in groups of 1,000 or more. Also on the right-hand side of the train, you can see some ostrich. The ostrich actually will get to the eight feet tall. They're a two-toed flightless bird. They walk through sea tracks as well as was determined by Henry of these family up and down. It was said to be sacred, which tells me that they must be holy cows. And at the same time, they were kept for their milk, not for their meat. 